So we know that to add 8, you can add 10 and then subtract 2, because 8 is equal to 10 minus 2. So how could you quickly add 28? Well, 28 is 2 less than 30. So if we add 30 to 64, we have 94. But we've added 30, so we've added 2 too many. So now if we take away 2, that gives us our answer, 92. So to add 28, we added 30, then subtracted 2. Now how could we add 18? Well, 18 is 2 less than 20, so we can add 20, then subtract 2. So if we add 20, we get 47, and now if we subtract 2, we have 45. Now pause the video and see if you can add 69 and 28, starting on 69. So 28 is 2 less than 30, so we can add 30 to 69 to give us 99, and now we take away 2 to give us 97. So to add 28, we added 30, then subtracted 2. How could we subtract 28? Well, we can subtract 30 easily, but that would be too, too many. So we need to subtract 30, then add 2. So 77 minus 30 is 47, and 47 add 2 gives us our answer, 49. So to subtract 28, we subtracted 30, then added 2. How could we subtract 48? 48 is 2 less than 50, so we can subtract 50, then add 2. So 83 minus 50 is 33, so 8 tens minus 5 tens is 3 tens, and we still have our 3 units. And now we add 2, which gives us 35. Now pause the video and see if you can subtract 18 from 44. So 18 is 2 less than 20, so we can subtract 20 then add 2, and that gives us 26.